My name is Jake and uh, this is me trying to get you through your Monday. This is video two. I guess we just better jump into it. I've got it, I've got it, here they come, they're good, here they come. How on earth is he making those, those motorbike sounds? What's that? Oh, oh he's not making those sounds. That's, that's my editor, he, uh, he takes care of everything for me. I mean, <laughs> the only time I get that excited is when I hear awesome positive things about the candidates that are running up for election this year. No, no, is that just me? The good news is the dad could probably prepare his casket. I mean, he's probably like done. He's lived a full life. <laughs> That's super adorable. But you even know what's more adorable than this clip right here? The next one. That must be like the new, the new iPhone. It's not, it's actually the Galaxy Note 7. Yeah, it kind of looks like it's in Korea and it's at a Burger King. Is that her phone or is, whose phone is that? See, there's great customer service in, uh, in Korea because look at that, uh, she's handling the burning phone with an oven mitt. Exploding phones? Uh, that's, that doesn't happen. Samsung Galaxy Note 7 phone started a fire that torched his beloved G. More on this exclusive story. Josh, that's scary stuff. You know, this is probably a marketing strategy from Apple because Samsung's trying to run them out of business. I'm just kidding, but like really, get a different phone if that's happening. Last one, guys. See this? Melbourne, Daytona Beach, all the way up to Jacksonville. This moves 20 miles to the west, and you and everyone you know are dead. All of you. Because you can't survive it. It's not possible, unless you're very, very lucky. So obviously he's talking about Hurricane Matthew, which happened recently. And your kids die too. That's offensive because he's assuming we all have kids. Hey, you can't say that about my future kids. They gotta watch motorbike races without jackets on. Wanna we'll see what this hurricane can do? We just got some brand new video in from the Bahamas. It's slow to get in, you know, because communications are bad, but watch this. This is a house. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Shep Smith, he just looks like a guy that knows exactly, he has every control of every word that's coming out of his mouth. See that? We can't play the audio because there's a wordy dirt in there. Why? Because there's a wordy dirt in there. Somebody said a dirty word when the house just got this man's sister out of there. She survived, barely. She decided not to evacuate. Uh, he's not very blunt about it at all. So that was a good idea. We got comments again. What and wordy dirt. To say that you and your kids are dead, that's just being a huge wordy dirt. Joke's on him. My kids are sharks. <laughs> Dope! It may just skirt, you know, it may just skirt Daytona, it may just skirt Jacksonville, it may just skirt Charleston. Skirt, 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 skirt. It may just skirt it, that may be all that happens. It may just skirt it, that may be all. Oh, wait, okay. Guys, I see a lot of comments of offended people, and I know that there's a lot of you that are offended, but I think dumber things have been said and backstage coverage we're seeing for the very first time. Serene. Well, a very, very heavy, uh, heavy vertation tonight. We had a very Darrison bite. Let's go hit Terrace Chase English for the bit. They had the pit. Probably speaking another language other than English when it's an English newscast. Why wouldn't she? I'm offended. As soon as I opened my mouth, I knew something was wrong. We'll be live all night long tonight. I won't be because I'm going to a family wedding. So if you're supposed to get out, go ahead and get out. Because if too many of you perish, they'll send me down there. And I need to go to this wedding. Okay? Thanks. <laughs> what? You know what? Like, I, I honestly think he's just being blunt. Just, there's people who won't listen. But I'm sure he affected that one person who evacuated. And, and he's grateful because he lost his home. But, but he's alive. Hey, guys. If you liked the video, um, like it. Uh, have a good Monday.